Good morning dear students welcome to science online class today we will discuss unit 3 energy students already we have learnt about energy energy means powers to do the work so now let us learn about heat energy so what is heat energy when the temperature of the substance raised and it releases the energy that is called as heat energy or thermal energy if we put some ice cubes into a water in a glass the water becomes cold isn't it because the heat is transferred from water to ice so the heat energy is transferred from one object to another students when you rub your hands together you feel heat this is because of friction between the hands so the friction produce heat so heat is a kind of energy so the heat energy is used to produce electricity in thermal power station and the heat energy from petrol and diesel is used to run the vehicles and the heat from the gas which is used to cook the food in our home isn't it next the heat is used to melt so many metals so students the heat energy is used in so many ways in our day to day life okay so now let's learn the uses of heat energy heat energy from thermal power station is used to generate electricity so students in thermal power station the heat is used to generate electricity next the heat energy is obtained from petrol and diesel is used to run the vehicles so the heat is produced from petrol and diesel which is used to run the vehicles okay so the heat energy is used in vehicles next we cook the food with the help of heat so the heat from the stove is used to cook the food in our home so the heat energy is used to cook the food next very hard metals like iron are heated and melted into the different shapes when iron and gold substance are heated they melted and change into different shapes so the heat energy is used to melt the metals next heat is used to dry the clothes and other wet substances here the wet clothes change into dry clothes because of heat from sun so the heat energy from the sun which is used to dry the clothes next the heat from the petrol and diesel is used to run vehicle next the heat from the stove is used to cook the food so these are the uses of heat energy students now we are going to study about light energy light is a form of energy that travel in the form of waves means light waves like a c waves it travels at the speed of 3 lakhs kilometer per second now look at this picture this is a sunlight the sun is a main source of light energy okay students during daytime we get light naturally from the sunlight uh, during the night time we get light from the moon naturally apart from these electric bulb electric lamp or the artificial light sources so we are able to see the object with the help of light energy so students the sun moon are the natural source of light and electric lamp bulb are the artificial source of light so all these light sources are used to see the objects without light we couldn't see anything so students we see all kinds of object with the help of light energy next plants use the light energy to produce their food students the leaves of plants prepare the food the plants use sunlight for preparing the food during day time so the plants use light energy to produce their food next with the help of light energy our skin is able to synthesize vitamin d so doctor always advise us to get sunlight during the morning time because the sunlight gives vitamin d so if you stand in the sunlight our skin produced vitamin d with the help of the light energy get from the sun next the electricity are produced with the help of the light energy means sunlight this is a solar panel which is used to observe the sunlight and produce electricity so students these are the important uses of light energy so light is a form of energy which is used in so many ways in our day to day life okay thank you students